Would you be willing to consume two of these each day to help repair your thyroid? And I'm talking about Brazil nuts for a very specific reason. Most hypo low thyroid condition problems is Hashimoto's. This is an autoimmune problem. It's not usually related to lacking iodine, but Hashimoto's is the most common type of autoimmune disease of all the autoimmune diseases. 14 million people a year get it just in the U.S. alone. And when you have Hashimoto's, you're more at risk of developing other types of autoimmune diseases as well. Hashimoto's thyroiditis, which is inflammation of the thyroid, doesn't always cause hypothyroidism, but usually it does. And so what's fascinating about these Brazil nuts is their selenium content and what selenium can do for Hashimoto's. I mean, it's mind blowing. First of all, selenium is a trace mineral needed in very tiny amounts. Selenium is involved in over 25 different genes involving antioxidants, giving anti-inflammatory effects. Selenium also is in shellfish and seafood and organ meats, but it's the highest in Brazil nuts. And so if you had two of these nuts, you would get close to like 200 micrograms of selenium every single day. In 17 randomized control trials, it has been shown that selenium reduces the antibodies that are attacking your thyroid. And selenium can slow down that attack. Even the way they diagnose thyroid conditions like hypothyroidism, they look at the hormone that's released from the pituitary that goes down to the thyroid. It's called the thyroid stimulating hormone. And when that hormone goes up, that means it's not connecting with the thyroid and chances are you have a hypothyroid condition. Well, it just so happens that selenium also helps that condition too. With an Hashimoto situation, you have a lot of hydrogen peroxide being generated. So by taking selenium, you can help neutralize the effect of hydrogen peroxide. And even too much hydrogen peroxide itself can trigger an autoimmune disease. Selenium also controls the T helper cells that orchestrate the entire immune response. And it also feeds the T reg cells preventing autoimmune diseases. And because our brain and our immune system and our reproductive system are so heavily dependent on selenium, there's probably not a lot left for the thyroid to have enough to function correctly. And so the person starts developing this Hashimoto's and they start getting tired, cold, they gain weight, hair loss, the hair becomes brittle. So here's what I would recommend. Start consuming two Brazil nuts per day. I mean, you could take a little bit more, maybe up to four, but I wouldn't take more than that because you could have problems with the deficiency of selenium and also a problem if you have too much selenium too. So you just need the right amount. In addition to Brazil nuts, I would also recommend either getting enough sun or taking high doses of vitamin D3. Why? Because vitamin D3 also helps to regulate an overactive immune system. Now, since I mentioned a little bit about vitamin D, I think there's some more to know about vitamin D in relationship to autoimmune diseases. So for that information, I put it up right here. Check it out.